JavaScript, making the page editable in the browser. Right to the browser console. Document body, content editable true. Now you can edit the page content. Let's change one minute coder to two minute coder. To disable editing, we write document body content editable equals false. A true believer does not taunt or curse or abuse or talk indecently. JavaScript event listeners. Let's add a button with the ID test and toggle colors written inside. We can access HTML IDs as global variables in JavaScript code. We have added an event listener. When the mouse hovers over the button, the setDark function will be called. Let's add another listener. We can attach multiple listeners to a single element. This time, when the mouse moves away from the button, the setLight function will be called. Let's add the setDark and setLight functions. When the setDark function is called, the background color of the document will change to black and the text color of the button will change to purple. When the setLight function is called, the background color of the document will change to white and the text color of the button will change to black. Let's try the code we have written and see what happens. When I hover the mouse over the button, the setDark function runs. When I move the mouse out of the button, the setLight function runs. When your companion dies, then do not abuse him. JavaScript object methods. Let's add an object named person. Let's add a few key value pairs. We call these key value pairs properties. Now let's add a method. When a function is used within an object, we call it method. When we invoke this method, it will write something to the screen. We can print the values of properties using dot notation. We can also invoke the methods using dot notation. When they are told, do not spread corruption in the land, they reply, we are only peacemakers. JavaScript, callback function. The function add takes A and B and returns their sum. And the divide function returns A divided by B. The calculate function accepts two numbers, x and y, and a function. When I call the calculate function, I am essentially invoking the function specified in the operation parameter. If I pass add, it returns the sum of x and y. If I pass divide, it performs the division operation. Let's pass two for x, two for y, the sum is four. Two for x, two for y, the division result is one. The add function is a callback because it is passed to another function for later execution. Seeking knowledge is an obligation upon every Muslim.